What's up guys, Willis Comics back with another video. It's been a minute, um, but I haven't really found a lot locally comic book wise, um, but I have within the past couple of days. First Facebook Marketplace listing in like probably over a month that I found and it was an awesome score. So I'm gonna go over that. It was a collection of about 150 books. Not gonna show off everything, but also I'm gonna show off the, uh, I'll take it back, I'll, I'll do that for a separate video, but I'm going to show off what I got from this Marketplace score. Um, it was about 150 books, not really high grade, nothing too crazy. Um, a lot of Marvel and DC stuff though, so I had a few handful of Flash books, some Batman, some Wonder Woman, some Superman, a little bit of X-Men, a um, couple of Spider-Man books, but not really, um, but nothing, it's just a lot of miscellaneous, nothing really set in stone in one direction. Um, but here, I'm just going to show off, obviously, the keys, some of the more recognizable and cooler books. So um, we got an ALF number one. It's kind of beat up, but again, it is an ALF number one. So cool little book there. ASM number, annual number 19. This thing is in great shape. Not an expensive book, but it's a cool cover. Mary Jane with the, doing like the Superman with Spider-Man's costume. This is pretty cool. This is uh, all about collecting comic books. I, it looks like it's from a, a news paper, um, but it's not, I guess it's some kind of like giveaway thing or whatever, but that was pretty cool. It doesn't go for a lot, but it's it's neat. Um, some uh, We had some Thor in there, Thor 378. There's some Iron Man in there, but this is a minor little key. So <clears throat> this was pretty cool. This is uh, Lex Luthor, uh, the unauthorized biography. You don't see that every day. Nothing too crazy though. <coughs> um, I might be keeping this one just because it's a price guide and I thought it was really cool. This is comic book collecting, uh, evaluation guide by Robert M. Overstreet. This is from 1990. So it's a price guide from 1990. Uh, so I'm probably gonna be keeping this. I think this is pretty cool. Um, an Action Comics reprint. I don't know which one this is, but it's like probably gonna be 10 to 20 bucks. Usually that's how, they, how much they go for. ASM annual number 21, the first, or the wedding of Peter, Parker, and MJ. So that's pretty cool. Avengers West Coast 56. I think this is the first dark something. Dark, I don't even know. I don't know who it is. Dark, I don't know. Maybe it's the evil version of Wanda or whatever. I don't know, but I know it's a key, like a $15, $20 key maybe. Um, but that's pretty cool. Uh, then we have Silver Surfer 34, The Resurrection of Thanos. I might keep this one. I'm not sure yet, um, but we'll see. But that's pretty cool. Then we have the top three books, which I'm going to show in a second. Basically, what happened was I found this. I looked on Facebook Marketplace, you know, like I usually do. And I, it's been weeks since I found anything. And this one I found. Um, I found this one two hours after it was posted. And I messaged a lady. And I was like, hey, you know, I didn't see anything. I saw this book and another one. And I was like, okay, maybe there's some something there. So I messaged her and I said, hey in the description said more photos ask for more photos so i asked for more photos and when i saw this certain book that you're going to see the last book the biggest book i instantly said i'll take it for 200 dollars because that's how much you listed it for so i didn't even bargain i just drove over there didn't did no questions uh nothing um but i got these are the top three books how are the duck number one uh beat up it's definitely not mint, but it is a cool book. How the Duck Number One. Um, definitely, it's first. It's his first solo title, so that was a pretty cool find. Nothing crazy there, but I like that. Uh, this is a cool cover. I like this book a lot. Again, not near mint. Uh, it's got a little bit of spine wear, but it's not bad. I mean, the press would do it a lot of justice. But we have Marvel Team Up One Forty One, the second appearance of the black costume, and that really cool. Is Daredevil and Spider-Man team up? Black Widow in the background, newsstand. That's a I like that cover. The first time I found that, that's very cool. And then this is the book that when I saw it, I 
dropped everything. I didn't didn't bother even negotiating because I wasn't gonna wasn't gonna miss out on this opportunity. Because again, it was posted two hours ago. I wasn't sure if somebody else was already messaging her or whatnot. So I just said, yeah, I'll, I'll take them. I'll drive over there right now. Um, but just to show you a little, I think this was cool. This was the bag it was in. It was a, I guess, I don't know what year this was, but very fine for 30 bucks. I don't know if you can see that, obviously. Very fine for $30. And this is the first time, this is probably, I think this is the best book I've found in the wild. Um, most expensive. Not the one that I've gotten because I didn't I didn't get the Hulk 180 in the wild. So this is the best book I've gotten in the wild though. This is Spider-Man 300, the first full appearance of Venom. Uh, and this thing is pretty clean. It is beautiful actually. It's not perfect, it's not a 9A, that's for sure. But I mean, that corner has got a little, I mean, it's, it's not perfect, but the spine is actually pretty beautiful. It's, it's not bad at all. And I paid $200 for 150 books. This might be a $700, $800 comic loan. So I am stoked about that. Um, that was definitely a great way to get back into it. Um, it's been over a month. So yeah, uh, you know, I got a major grail for super cheap. Um, Cause I paid it, what, probably a dollar 30 a book or something, something like that. But yeah, um, that's it. I have a, I also went to a garage sale today, but I'm gonna make a separate video for that, which was actually another pretty good score. That was a success. So I'll show that off, uh, probably upload it the same day or the next day. But yeah, thanks for watching and until next time.